Be interested to add Maya versus Carolina Mukova is a third quarter final for the US Open of 2024. Both players will not expect to get this far. Mukova into the tournament, unseeded, and will take on Volley Nets in the first round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6 3 7 5. In the second round, you take on Osaka, who just beat the number 10 seed Ostapenko in the previous round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6 3 7 6. In the third round, you take on Potapova, who are taking out Fernandez along the way. And again, no problem for Mukova getting through in straights. 6 4 6 2. In the fourth round, you take on Paulini, the fifth seed, who just come off back to back Grand Slam finals at the French Open in Wimbledon. But again, Mukova too strong, getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-3 to advance to the quarterfinals. But Dad tomorrow entered the tournament as a number 22 seed. We'll take on Avanesian in the first round. And after dropping the first set, we'll fight back to win. 4-6, six, 6-6, six, love 6-2. Six, in the second round, she'll take on Tormo. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-2, six, 6-1. Six, in the third round, she'll take on Kalinskaya, the 15th seed. And after a little bit of controversy in the first set, we'll win in straights. 6-3, six, 6-1. Six, in the fourth round, she'll take on Wozniaki, who'd been having a dream run to get to this stage. After splitting the first two sets, we'll win in three. 6-2, six, 3-6, three, six, six, three, to advance to the quarterfinals. These were played three times before, with Mukova winning all three matches, including a match last year in Cincinnati. However, that was much closer than the previous two matches. Mukova getting through in a very close three-setter. So this should be a really interesting match, considering that Mukova has been out for the best part of 12 months, and Adaj Meyer, of course, trying to get back to that top level that she was at a couple of years ago. If Mukova's going to win this one, she needs to use that variety like she used against Paulini. That net game is so, so strong. And the fact that she can change things so drastically within the match and keep their opponents off, off guard, that's going to be crucial if she's going to beat Adaj Meyer. If Dajmai's going to win this one, she needs to just battle it out and get everything back. She's a great defender. Also use that lefty serve, which has been a great weapon of hers over the time because she's a lefty and that's going to be very interesting to see how Mukova can deal with that. And also maybe use the crowd because there is a big Brazilian crowd that come to the US Open as well. So it could be really interesting to see if the crowd does side with the Dajmaya, if she can use that to her advantage too. Such a random matchup. I don't think anyone expected this to be the match that we'd get in the quarterfinals. But I have to go with Mukova in this one. I think Mukova with the 3-0 head-to-head, -head, but also just in general. She's been so good this week and the way she beat Pal he was so impressive, so I have to go with her in a close three setter. But let me know then comes by who's gonna make the semis.